Oh, well, hello, Leanne Rhymes. How are you? Jeremy, it's good to see you. So, how are you? Okay, look, you, we were just, I was just gushing over you a bit. I'm doing that a lot tonight oh, for some reason because well, I'm just in. in the air. Yeah. Uh, a very loving, like, energy here tonight. There really yeah. is. And that's part of what Music Cares is. There, there is that, that vibe. But then, as, as a fan of yours, you've been in the business a while. Uh, it seems that Grammys weekend and week and all the events leading up to it are really special. Yeah. Talk some about that and what this particular event, why it stands out as something every year that people look forward to. Oh, wow. Um, well, first, we get to honor an artist that we've all loved for decades normally is what is it happening, um, especially Aerosmith. I mean, I love Steven. I've been a fan and friend with him for years now, and uh, yeah, I'm excited to be here honoring them. But Music Cares is a fantastic organization. I mean, we, it's nice to have a community of musicians that support each other, um, a place to go in time of need, whether it be a low moment in your life, addiction, whatever it is, they really do support musicians and artists and uh, that's why we're here mm. mainly is to to really feed that, yeah. that community you know yeah. and you know Jeremy and I were peeping your Instagram earlier and you posted the <laughs> cutest holiday photo with your modern family yes how wonderful is it to be at this place where everyone's just in a happy place and you can all hang it's out together it's good um yes I mean you know we are a blended family and it has the funny thing is like it has its moments like as we're all together but they're funny they're like yeah. not what you would normally think nobody's fighting nobody's doing anything weird it's, family. it's just yeah it is and it's really it's interesting the kids are older now you know right. one's 17 almost almost 17 yeah. and almost 13 so um it's fun it's like it's nice and quiet and nice and quiet it's yeah. good yeah and the kids are happy and yeah it's all that matters a lot of people relate to that what is the key to making the blended family work oh wow is there one? I don't know. I don't know. Well, you guys have figured it out. You figured We've, it out. Uh, I don't know. I think it really, for me, it's about, first off, I'm going to get really deep for it. It's about working. It was working on myself um, to be able to feel confident and uh, secure in my own self. And I think everything else around me changed. But I, I also think you really do have to consider everyone's feelings and you have to let, allow people to have them and you can't take them personally and like all the things which is easier said than done, sure, yeah. um, but at least we shoot for that, yeah. you know? So. And you know, and people, we, we love to hear from artists um, going through those real life moments that a lot of people relate to, and, and that is some of the theme of tonight as well, like figuring out how to make it through tough times. When you think back about maybe some of those times you were talking about when you had to really reconcile things with yourself, what helps you through? Oh, wow. Um, I know, we're getting here. Yeah, just, well, there's man. a lot of things. Um, <laughs> Honestly, I know there's a lot of talk about loving myself, um, yeah, right. but, and I still, every day, like, to love all the parts of you, to welcome all the parts of you and not try to, uh, to push them away, um, recognizing that what is showing up in your world at the moment is there for your best, best interest, your highest good, and learning from it, I guess looking at it from that angle instead of, oh my God, as a victim, what's happening to me? realize this is happening for my highest good this is for my growth and so I think just that flip of uh, you know the frame of mind is um, really helpful is this the kind of age with the kids where it's like let's cash in the chips it's a Grammys weekend we want to go to after parties get us in mom oh is um, it that kind of, you know no they're not that way at all really? actually no um, they... Because I would be all about, like, <laughs> it's time to cash them in. Yeah, no, right, totally. No, they're not that way at all. Okay. They're so chill. I yeah. think if they're being around all of us, they're yeah, like, yeah. whatever. Of like, course. yeah, no one's that cool. So, yeah, <laughs> trust me, they, they put us in our place. You're like, yeah. what do you do again? Like, yeah. what? Yeah. You've been famous since you were so young. How do you stay so grounded now at this point in your career? Oh, wow. Um, I think it's my own self. Like, honestly, like, really... I guess separating and also separating the Leanne Rhymes entity basically is what it is right. from the me. brand of Leanne Rhymes yeah, from the real person. For right? me, yeah. but also com at the same time combining that and making it one whole piece because I feel like it's so easy to be so fractured because we have this thing that's kind of outside of us that's bigger than larger than life, you know, and um, to bring that into one whole human instead of feeling like it's always so far outside of me yeah. and this whole different thing. Um, has been really important for me. So just kind of coming back into self and staying grounded is really a huge you part so of my life. Yeah. We're all about we're all about Aerosmith tonight. <laughs> yes. Number one Aerosmith song for you. 
Oh, wow. So many. Um, crazy or yeah. crying? I'm a 90s chick, so yeah, like, right. I was introduced to Aerosmith with the song I'm singing tonight, Living on the Edge. Um, Ooh, that's a good one. Yeah, it's gonna be fun. You're gonna belt it? I mean, are you like going all, all I'm in? Doing all, I'm you have all to. Over. You have yeah. to do it. I start out not so in, and then I go all for it. <laughs> like, obviously, yeah. You're like, no, just, I'm gonna give it like that. But if anyone can belt, it's you. Well, I start out, but I mean, my not so in is I start out just by myself. So yeah. it's like acapella at the beginning, and then we go to like oh, the soccer yeah. yeah. When Steven Tyler's sitting there looking at you, does that make you more nervous, or is it like, yeah, we can settle in? I know the guy. Yeah, I want him to get up on stage with me, is what I want. Oh, like, nice. Okay. We'll yeah, see if it happens. We'll see if it happens.